and Luca Amendola. I work at the University of Heidelberg in Germany. I'm the lead of the theory working group in Euclid. The theory working group is the group in which we discuss about theoretical ideas of Euclid, of interest to Euclid mission. For instance, uh, the theory of uh, modification of gravity, or which is the nature of dark energy. DE means dark energy. It is an acronym we use a lot in Euclid, in Euclid documents. Dark energy is what we are looking for, essentially. It's the main goal of the Euclid mission. Dark energy is a fluid or a substance, we don't know yet exactly how to describe it, which is supposed to drive the accelerated expansion of the universe. The accelerated expansion of the universe has been discovered a few years ago. We know that it's there, it's a real effect, but we don't know what is really driving it, which means what sort of matter or energy is driving this accelerated expansion. The main hypothesis is that it is a new form of energy that gets the name dark energy, which is supposed to be dark, so not to absorb, not to emit light, and it's supposed to be a sort of energy in the sense that uh, we think it is very evenly distributed in, in space. It doesn't form clustered structures like galaxies or stars. One interesting idea about dark energy is that it's not really a fluid at all, but actually a modification of gravity. We think that we know gravity very well, but actually we do so only on some scales in the solar system or in the galaxy. And we don't know very well how gravity behaves at very large distances. So it could be that at the end of the day, you could will discover that the expansion of the universe is not due to a form of matter like the one we are used to know around us, but actually to a modification of the force of gravity.